This is where we're at today, so pause that <laughs> so you can read it. And take a look. <laughs> Down there we got a sign, do not wash tracks. Mm -hmm. Don't wash them. <laughs> that is really cool. Cafe Observation, Texas State Railroad. Oh, check out this little dollhouse. That is so cute. Yeah, we'll have to leave the link of where we actually saw the world's smallest dollhouse. Yeah. See, this is this is <laughs> this is this is it. This is. <laughs> All right. Well, come here, babe. Say hey. Good morning. Guess what? I'm Daniel. And I'm Carla. And we are Hoover's on the Move. Yes, and we are. And today we are out here in just outside of Palestine, Texas. And we are here at the Texas State Railroad. And what we're going to do today is we're going to take a railroad ride. Yes, we are. It's going to be fun. So uh, it's going to be a, it's a total of a four hour uh, they trip. Yeah, they call it excursion. Yes. And we're, we're even going to be having lunch on there and everything. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're going to bring you guys yeah. along with us. It's yeah. almost time for us to check in. So yeah. um, watch this commercial and we'll, we'll be, be right back. back. Turn us off. We turn back on. There we go. <laughs> Lighting's not so great right here, guys. I'm a little bit back, like backlit. But take a look. Listen to this. When I saw this excursion, I knew then I definitely needed to try to get us booked on this. So the Piney Woods Express Diesel Excursion is powered by a restored FP9 passenger unit. TSR125. If any of y'all know a lot about trains, leave us some comments. I don't know a lot about trains. But it oh, is woo -woo. <laughs> remarkably restored engines aren't just for show. General Motors built 481 of these FP9s and FP7 locomotives to haul passengers during the golden age. So we are going to be on a vintage 1920s car with some relaxed seating, decor. We're gonna have attendees. We actually ordered lunch. Um, so it's a four hour round trip where you are going to be on the train for about an hour, 20 minutes-ish. And then you're gonna have an hour and 20 minutes-ish excursion you know getting off that's a lot of issues that's a lot of issues um and then we come back so there's supposed to be some narratives um fun facts along the way as well so we're going to bring you guys along with us stay tuned because it's going to be a fun ride and here they got the open air carts and they've got the, the engine. train out there. We got the engine. It says Texas State Railroad. And it's got a caboose. Looky there. So we're gonna so leave cute. You, I know I've already said it once, but we're gonna leave you all the details down below on how much it costs and all of that in the card that we actually picked. I can tell you that the most economical way to do this is the open air. At this time of frame, it's only like $27 a person very cheap um but you have no ac <laughs> <laughs> so i actually have a little bit of cloud it, cover today so it's only probably in the 80s in texas but. um right now it is definitely <laughs> um almost july okay and um we are literally with heat indexes of 110 so i did not want to choose that option um so we're a little further back in the in the train <laughs> <laughs> yeah they got the little railroad up there get your little railroads mm -hmm. get your little backpack and get your little engineer kit look at these for three-year-olds they're so adorable got a little hat and it's got a it's got a train whistle mm -hmm. 
They have books and t-shirts. Kids t-shirts are running about $17.99. They got us big kid stuff too. <laughs> There's their hats, little engineer hats. That's cool. Look at that. Texas State Railroad. They got mugs, they got all kinds of stuff over here. Got little K pods so you can make you a cup of coffee. Three books. Life is better when you ride the, the rails. rails. <laughs> okay. Established in 1881. <laughs> Be original, not ordinary. <laughs> there you go. We've got some wine going on over here with their little fancy little wine glasses. That's pretty cool. Little fork screws. They've got all kinds of stuff. And a Lambert. Wine by Miranda Lambert. Yep. That's pretty cool. Now I may have to buy a bottle. Dang. Got all kinds of glasses. Little magnets, keychains, coffee cups, your normal stuff. Get your little polar bears. I guess the Polar Express has been through here before because they got Polar Express bears. Yes, sir. They do offer different types of excursions. One of them is the Polar Express during Christmas. I mean, look at this. Is this not too cute? I love this. My, our grand, $17.99. Our granddaughter would love that. Does this guy look familiar? <laughs> Pick up your board games. This is all Polar Express edition over here. This whole corner is. Oh, I see. Yeah. Two little candy bowls. History stuff in here. Yeah, there is. Oh, history cards. Oh, yeah. Beautiful pictures. <laughs> they call this one the workhorse. That's the workhorse. <laughs> <laughs> He's got his steel toes on him. See the people up there. The dome. <laughs> Car 509 is the only one that is actually two story, and that is we are going to be on that car there. So, all aboard! Here we go. We got to get our get our tickets clipped. <laughs> I guess think it's got a, got a vigorous tear. All right, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm recording. <laughs> Suck it in so we can go upstairs. Dome 509, that's yeah, what we're that's on. Right. Only beyond this point, yeah. that's us. <laughs> and then you can go straight down there, hit that one, or you can go up the stairs, very skinny, and go to the top. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. Nice little goodies. And then you have a whole menu that's going to have concessions and drinks and things from the bar. Now or, we had already online ordered mm -hmm. um, a turkey sandwich with provolone cheese. And when it comes, I'll talk to you guys about it. But I also ordered some chicken strips and mac, uh, mac and cheese kind of thing. We're going to try some things out. And that comes with the soda pop. I believe it comes with a drink, yes. But then they have other drinks on there, alcoholic drinks mm -hmm. that uh, you can also They have Bloody Marys and margaritas. Wine, signature and drinks. And exactly. That uh, uh, are at an extra charge. Correct. Yes. And if you do the wine, it's sold by the bottle. So, just FYI. Yep. And we saw some of those inside because mm -hmm. they oh. also have those in the store. In the, yeah, gift shop.
So what all do we have here? I got some ranch and I got lots of cheeses. I've got some sharp cheddar. All right, everyone, let's have a cheers to a fun and safe trip. Cheers. 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 I had a feeling they were going to do that. <laughs> what else we got? We got grapes. I got oh, the most Andy's favorite. Candy. Andy's candy. So anyway, oh yeah, Lindor's. <laughs> <laughs> I got a cracker. That's a big one. Yeah, it's a big one. We got blackberry. <laughs> Cucumbers. Yummy, yummy, yummy. What's this? What's that? Ooh, that's a little wrap. You got a wrap? Yeah. Hey, that's a wrap. stairs right here and then if you look I can't go back there because uh, it's for residential guests only but this is like a little area <laughs> and then you got to go down here Ooh. to go to the restaurant and it's loud Oh, 
Um, the old middle school was back there. There was like four students that went there, so now they're all on the bus. And is that right there? Hello? Right there is Big Bird. Hello? Oh my goodness, can you? Why does it sound like she's got life? That's Kinley. Right there, you're just messing up. Okay, that's kind of fucked up too, but it's best. Like, Green Motor right there is Big Breakfast Cafe. Right there is a bar department. Luckily, they're volunteers to save my mouth for a second Breakfast Cafe right now. And then the community got together and raised money to get. Go ahead. And raised money to get her another life. This is the turntable, and still, that's where it's going to raise money. Station elevation 435. So, how much, Carla? This is where we're going to have uh, we're gonna have a little meal here. We're going to be here for about an hour and 20 minutes, and then we're going to mount back up and head back the other way and head back to the other station. Just uh, got a little delayed because of the tree on the. How is Palestine? And then you got Rusk. We're at Rusk now, and then we'll be headed back around to Palestine again. That's their little schedule. When they toot that horn, you come running. They give you a five-minute warning with one toot, and then uh, when they give you that second one, that's it. They're out of here. That's our little uh, crew there that was taking care of us. Come out, there's a rest station. And then we're out here. They got this big old pond out here. It says that they're swimming, but you swim at your own risk. No lifeguard. I don't see where anybody goes swimming in there, but that looks really cool though that is nice big old lily pads out there it's not the season for the flowers to come with the lily pads but you know isn't that pretty that's awesome choo-choo train see a choo-choo train he's uh unhooking the engine from the cars he's gonna go down and he's gonna come back around hook up to the other side of the train so it pull us right back to Palestine Station. And there he goes. Ding, 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 ding. Remember how we told you that we pre-ordered our food? So if you get off the train, you kind of walk around, do a little bit of sightseeing. Hang on a minute. Before you <laughs> do a little sightseeing, then you come over here and get, get in the, the pre-ordered line. Literally, there's nobody here hardly. So, kind of give you a little tidbit. <laughs> we go inside the car here. I ain't come out right here. Small train car. Heard the choo-choo train. Mm -hmm. It's coming yeah. around to hook up over there. It's actually inside a rail car. <laughs> Thank you. 
you just go out and see. She did it online, so she actually had these little vouchers that have exactly what we ordered. And you just give them to the people and they give it to you. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's the easy way to do it. So what do we got? Let's see. So our little box comes like this. Comes with chips. And we have a turkey sandwich that she pre-ordered before we came. And then it's got a little baggie here. It's got tomato and lettuce and stuff like that in it. So that way you can make it up. And of course, Condiments. utensils, condiments, all that stuff is all down there. And you just pick what you need. And I forgot I changed mine to a chicken sandwich. Ah. So. Well, I'm the turkey. Mm. We'll see. That is a wasp on the window, guys. From our window. And he has got a loaded mouth. <laughs> Full food. Hey, we're at Petticoat Junction. You know, you didn't get that side. This one looks like. Oh, nice. Oh, that's pretty I cool. Like it. Yeah. <laughs> Number nine. That's the engine that pulled us back and forth. Car 1511, which is presidential, which is what we just showed you. And then the next car down was what I call the bubble car. It's car 509, that's the one we rode in over to Rusk and back. 
which is an hour and a half over there and an hour and a half back. So let's go check out these other cars. So that's pretty cool. Yes, so it's got the chairs with the tables on one side and it's got the couches on the other. Those look pretty plush too. Hello. Hi. That's pretty nice. And that's your view out the window. It was car 42. Now we're going into car 40. This is being cleaned. Uh, got the regular tables and chairs over here. Each one of them is different. Pretty cool. You got your seat numbers and everything right there on the. How many people well, did you have on your car? Today I had 47, but it seat up to 64. Wow. 47. You had 47 people. in here. Yeah, but it seats up to 64, huh? Well, that's cool. Yeah. We were in a dome. Yes. And this is 60, which is the concessions car. So while you're going down the road, you can come here, you can get your drink, you got your popcorn, looks like pretzels. And a little soda pops, thank you, babe. Got some chips. The popcorn was delicious. Oh, wow. This is kind of cute. This is cute. <laughs> it almost looks like a, dining, like a dining car. Yeah, yeah. looks like old school. The windows open. Oh, these windows are. <laughs> For sure oh, wow. what the number on this cart is but this is actually the, the open, open air. air one so see yep there's no uh no windows here i'm like oh no so yes this is the open air one here so there is no AC here. You got these fans, which you probably don't feel when you're going down the going down the track. So. This is original old school. <laughs> so, yeah. so this is car 129, which is the caboose. It is no doubt a caboose. Old school. Check this out. Mama's got the deets on it. I do. So this one here cost $850 on this particular trip. Um, and it was for eight people. This was booked today. So, um, but it does go up from there, but it's really phenomenal because you have your own, it's only eight people in here, it's your own party, and um, you have your own attendant, and you get uh, waters and snacks and stuff like that. There's a lot of included things, but this is like the top of the, you know, the top tier, so. Shut the door. <laughs> so here, this is in the middle of the caboose. And these are some seats that are just sitting up there. So you got your little observation. And that's, I mean, that's up there. If I mean, you're a train conductor, you know what these were actually used for. <laughs> um, but they would always have the, you know, the conductor at the very front of the engine. And then they would have people back here. And they would flag at each other. That's why the windows open up. 
um, to, to say that all is good, all bored, what have you. And then they would sit up here. But, you know, this is not for that anymore, so. <laughs> <laughs> but literally, the train track is right out our door because the engine is at the, at the other side right now. Yep, this is the back of the caboose. And so that's where we just came from. So that's pretty neat. And we got to tour the whole, the whole train, all the different cars. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It really was a fun, uh, fun video to shoot. And um, I have to, don't forget, you know, hit that subscribe button. Um, you know, smash, smash the like button, thumbs up it, please. Uh, our channel is growing every single day. And um, it's all because of you guys helping us out and we really appreciate it. But um, the scenery is just gorgeous, love it. Well, we're going to, I guess, get ready to call it a day. We're back with it again. <laughs> Does that help? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, let's see. I'm on a catwalk. Aha, there we go. So we I found us again. <laughs> so I guess all in all, it's <laughs> been an absolutely wonderful day. We've had a great time. Um, it is now hitting what four close to four o'clock and um we've been at this since 11 so that's a it's an incredible ride yeah. so um don't forget to check out all the details down below and um in case it's something you're interested in you can always contact me i can help you out um i don't know anything else babe nope. lunch was delicious yes have to say I do, I do, I do say that was a really good, uh, was, I had a turkey sub and it was, it was really for good. For 10 bucks, guys, $10. Yeah. Um, um, you know, you that's got. that and a drink and chips and. Right, uh, it was, it was really good. So, yeah. um, nice and cold. I had the chicken sandwich and, um, it was very delicious. Very, very full. Um, the bun was absolutely perfect. So, lunch was great. The company was great. I just, we had a great time. So. so until next time, keep it between the rails. Subaru's on the move. We're out. See ya. Goes our choo choo train. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs>